It's Transformers 96 here in another very review. This time we have Transformers Animated Rodimus Minor. So uh, here he is. I um, The review before this was Iron Eye. So now I'm finishing off with Rodimus Minor. The two um, the two new uh, Transformer uh, molds that um, they just released. So it's great. Um, these are very hard to come by and very hard to find. They're about, you know, 25, maybe 30 each on eBay. Last time I checked. And um, so I was incredibly lucky to find them, you know, I was just at a Toys R Us looking through all of the ratchets, you know, like about ten ratchets and that's it. So, um, you know, I was a little disappointed. I knew there wasn't much hope of finding it, but I was a little disappointed. So, you know, I kept going. And then, um, just, you know, in like the Star Wars section, I think it was, right behind one of the toys was these two guys. So, um, obviously somebody put it there to, they planned on coming back and buying it, and they never did. So, um, so I definitely picked it up, um, and, uh, was so relieved and happy. It was amazing because when I saw the back of Iron Eye, um, the kid, the back of Iron Eye's case, uh, you know, I saw him. But since it was a repaint of Ratchet, I thought, oh, it's probably just a Ratchet. But the the lights making it a little orange. But then I picked it up, saw that it was the orange Ratchet. So happy, and then um the Iron Eye, and then um when I after I picked it up, right underneath it was Rodimus Minor. So. Very pleased, very happy, and um, so let's talk about the toy. So here you go. Um, he does come with a bone and arrow that actually shoots. You can attach it on here. It doesn't really snap in too well, um, but uh, you know it's okay. Uh, it looks a little dumb on the car. I think most people think. Uh, I don't really like it on the car either. But um, yeah. But other than that, this is a very good car. Um, definitely like it. The hot rod. Yeah, probably look good next to um lockdown, but I don't have him, so yeah, but still it's a very good toy. So let's get to transforming it. Just gonna flip it, okay, and then just start breaking up the panels. Just take his foot. There you go, just kinda get it up. Same on this side, just to get it all unsnapped. Just a bit. It's just it's very the panels on here are very tightly snapped on, so you really have to pull. There you go. Oh, sorry if you didn't see that. Let me get to this side. So you have to pull. There you go. Okay, so there. Now all you're going to do is um, take, uh, move the symbol. There you go. Hold on. Just rotate the symbol. There you go. So you can see the engine here. You can see the Autobot symbol there. So now on this side, all you're going to want to do is fold in these tires and um, split the panels. On the side, which are his arms, they kind of fold down like that. There you go, very simple. Now what you're going to want to do is raise this blue part, and then his body and head will fold down, and then just put it back to where it was, and then um, fold out his hands. Rotate this. Just don't put it there. Rotate it. Put it there. And then I just rotate the whole waist. Go move this engine, move it up or spoilers, whatever. Move it up. There you go. And then almost done here, just move this up. Sorry, it was like this. Move it up and fold it down. And there you have Rodimus Meyer in his uh, robot mode. There you go. Very cool. Very awesome. Um, he's gotten kind of sun paint job going on here, you know, a little bit red, yellow, orange, all that kind of stuff. Um, so uh, it's a very good paint job, I think. The, um, this artwork is fantastic on the cover, I think. I forgot to mention that in the beginning. But yeah, and then um, he, you can uh, hold the bow. It's a very tight grip, which is good. It's also a little hard to snap on because it's so tight. There you go keeps firing the gun, so there he's got a nice, you know, um, bow and arrow, so very cool, very awesome, and uh, you can kind of get him in some very cool poses, obviously both of the bows shoot, press this button, there you go, and press this button, they don't shoot very well, really at all, but um, but it, it's pretty okay, it looks fine, so uh, you can get this guy in some cool poses, just be kind of like looking almost holding it. He doesn't reach all the way to hold it, but you can kind of get that kind of like feel that he's 
holding it for this arm too. So uh, yeah, this is a very decent toy. I really like it. The only complaint that I have is um his face sculpt. It is very plain. He doesn't have any emotion. I would have loved a face sculpt more like the one on the box with tons of emotion. This one is just kind of plain. But you know, what are you going to do with it? It's pretty okay. It's decent. You can live with it. But um, this is a very good toy. I don't know anything about this character. I don't know his personality. I don't know anything because I haven't seen any episodes with him or Iron Eyed um, in... I haven't seen an episode of either of them. So any episodes that you know, just send me a message with um, the episode number and what series. I mean, um, season, so that I can look it up and watch it. So let me get them both together. They are quite awesome. As you can see, Iron Knight is a little bit taller than Rider Miss Meyer, but his legs are bent a little bit more. But um, this guy, he's got the great bow and arrow I really like. His accessory is better than him. And, um... They just look cool, like their head sculpts, a little bit more emotion needed. This one's pretty got, you know, a nice little smile there, it's kind of good emotion. These are both Autobots, obviously, so, um, I'm, if I, these are my first animated, uh, Autobots. You know, I collect the, dev, um, what's a, wow, I can't even think of them. Okay, well, whatever, um, but, um, I collect the Decepticons, there you go, sorry about that, the Decepticons I collect, but um, I don't collect these uh, Autobots, but since they were so rare, so popular, thought I'd better pick them up as soon as I saw them. They also look cool with the unreleased Blackout, so uh, yeah, you can get them in some poses with him, you know, firing something at Blackout, Blackout, you know, firing something at, at him, you know. So they're pretty cool together, especially since... Those are the three uh, new toys since the show was cancelled, so that's very cool. Um, definitely like them. Joints are all pretty sturdy on uh, all of them. Their panels pretty much notching together very good. Um, the only complaint is his shoulders. They don't attach anywhere. They just kind of stay there. But it's okay. It looks fine. You can't even tell. So uh, these are very good toys. I definitely, definitely pick them up if you see them because they're so rare and so popular. But if you're just on the fence... And uh, you happen to see them, I say go ahead. Even if they weren't rare or popular, then you know you should probably get them. It really depends if you like them in the show. But um, now that they're rare and popular, definitely pick them up if you see them. So that's my video review of uh, Rodimus Meyer Transformers Animated. Thanks for watching.